Oh, the heart is dinky do. It's just me, Scotty McClue. Friday night, nothing gets past me, of course. Yes, sharp as a tack, old McClue, you know. And uh, it's just a quick pop up, early tea time pop up. Now, I know you're all at your tea. I've heard all that nonsense, but you can multitask because you're very, very talented people. So there's every chance that you'll be able to multitask during this broadcast. You can watch Scotty McClue and you can have your tea at the same time or your evening meal or you can get dressed for dinner some of you might be going out on the town all that sort of stuff but you can spare a few minutes to watch Scotty McClue's Friday night pop up just for you to say dinky do to everyone of who's watching out there and watching throughout the world Irene Garvey dinky do welcome welcome I say lovely to have you with us Michelle Dunlop excellent welcome to the program Jimmy Reynolds watching so there you are now tell Ted to tell Ted to tell Ted to tell Ted folks very very important it's been a fabulous week and 20,000 of you have watched the Scotty McClure pop-ups. It's becoming a world phenomenon. But share, share, share. Tony Bamford, good evening. Dominic McIntyre, Paul Wilkinson, and Finn and Carey. All right, all right, Finn. Nice to have you with us. And dinky-doo, I say. Now, very special, of course. A lot of you, holiday weekends, things like that. You've got a million things to do. Just finish work. Good afternoon, says Michael Connor. A very good afternoon to you, Michael. And lovely to have you with us. You're all watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, the first lot of the internet, with our Friday evening pop-up. Looking smart, Scotty son. Just come from the office, son. So there we are. You've got to make an effort, haven't you? Uh, especially when you're hoping to make a career out of it. Hello, handsome, says John Adams. Hello, John Adams. And uh, Wadge is there. Dinky-doo, Wadge. Lovely to have you with us. Dinky-doo. Lovely to have you there. You went dunk because your predictive text was all over the place. Wedge, you've got to watch that. I'm telling you, it's one of these things that gets all of us all the time that. So there you are. Alan Humphrey's watching. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClure, and we are, of course, live on the big one. Now, a bit of sharing to go on, as always. So there you are. I'll have to get somebody else to do the sharing. If you can all share, that would be fantastic. And uh, I shall do the sharing as well. There I am. So I'll just share. No problem at all. And I'll kick a kick around the corner. So we kick around the corner. It's raining. What's it like at Dinky Doo Towers? Raining. That's why I thought, what am I going to do? I can't go out in the rain. I can't put the washing out. You haven't aged a bit. I remember you on Scott FM when it launched, says uh, Gordon Barry. The Monday books, Gordon Barry. Lovely to have you with us. You are spot on. I don't think I have aged. Everybody says that. So there you are. Paul Maxwell's watching. Excellent. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Now, let's get the sharing. Share now. Let everybody know that we are on Big Style. If all of you can share... That would be excellent. Stuart McPherson, come and join us. You're watching Scotty McClure. It's the Friday night pop-up just for you. The weekend is starting, but you can't have the weekend starting if you haven't said dinky-doo to Scotty McClure, if you haven't joined with the rest of the universe. That's how big this show is becoming, guys. An absolute phenomenon right across Facebook. So there you are. You can't say fairer than that, can you? Jerry Gallagher's watching. Uh, 20,000 of you have watched this week alone. Two and a half million of you have watched the Scotty McClue shows and the pop-ups. I think that's excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But keep sharing. Tell everybody about it. There's 1.8 billion people on Facebook and there's no reason why every single one of them should not be watching Scotty McClure at this time. Elizabeth Campbell's joined us and Fiona Gibbons. Excellent, excellent. Now I know some of you can only watch. You can't join us because you're maybe um, coming back from the office or you're with people or some of you are still in meetings or you're trying to look after the wee ones all that stuff that's totally acceptable 100% but try and multitask keep my clue on so you can see us and come and join us and build and build and build Fiona Gibbons and Frank 
Crossley, Gary, Gary Frank Crossley. John Wilson says, good evening, Scotty, dinky do. Good evening, John. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Lovely to have you with us. And nothing wrong with that. Harry Knollis is watching down in the borders. Dinky do, Harry. Have you got the rain down there? The rain in Spain stays mainly on the plane. I am reliably informed. So they are, feels like a song, doesn't it? It's sort of like a, a cue for a song. If you've just joined us, folks, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, and we are, of course, live on the big one. This is the new television. This is it all happening. You should do a show for our internet music station called Big MG Playing Oldies. Now I need to play youngies. I'm a young man. So there you are. Maybe in another 20, 30 years, I'll play the oldies, you know, but uh, the young stuff, that's what uh, what McClure plays. Absolutely. Danny Boyle watching. Dinky do, Danny. Lovely to have you with us and a very warm welcome to Scotty McClure's Friday evening pop-up. I thought I'd just do this before you all have to go and watch the news. You know, that kind of thing. You think, are we watching the news? Are we watching Scotty McClure? Hmm. Hmm. Let's just watch Scotty McClure, dinky do. And Grathilda is watching. Grathilda, the earth picket. The earth picket. Have I got that right? Am I saying it? Grathilda, the earth picket. Am I saying that? Looking smart, Scotty? Yes, you have to make an effort, don't you, Grathilda? We, uh, we national and international global film stars, we have to look our best when we're out in front of the nation. That's why I always wear my best tweed jackets and my best cap. I don't know if you saw the late night pop up last night. Very, very nice cap on there. Sid Devine's watching. Dinky Doo said, come and join us. John P. Hazelton, Dinky Do Scotty. Dinky Do John P. Good to have you with us. How about joining Talk Radio, says Tony Bamford. Now, that's an interesting one. I noticed that we have a new station called Talk Radio, and everybody tells me it's very good. But, uh, of course, McClure should be on a Talk Radio station. I mean, that makes sense, doesn't it? You say my surname very well. The Erzbicate. The Erzbicate. There we are, Grathilda. Am I saying it properly? You must tell me. You've got to give me an indication. Scotty McClure is very good at following instructions. Never a problem. So that's what's going on there. Yes. So talk radio. So who knows what the future might bring? There are lots and lots of discussions with very, very senior people in the British media. And uh, McClure will uh, will be popping up somewhere. I have no doubt. Grathilda, very good. Grathilda Viersbikit. So Viersbikit, lovely. Viersbikit, lovely. There we are. Yes, that's it. I'm getting it. A bit of practice, Cathilda. I think that's what people need. And then they can press on with it. Now, if you've joined us, folks, dinky do. I hope you're having a happy Friday and uh, that you're not working too hard. A lot of you, I understand, will miss this broadcast, but you can catch up later once you know what's happening. I'm just going to do a bit more sharing. And as I say, if you can all do the same, that would be absolutely fantabulous. So there we are. Lee Ferns watching. Lee, Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Friday Night Pop-Up with Scotty McClue. Thanks for sending me the link for last night's show, says Tony Bamford. No problem, Tony. You're very, very welcome. Thanks for watching, I say. Two-way traffic. It takes two to tango. Uh, hey, Scotty, says Colin McGregor. Hey, Colin McGregor. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky-doo with your salt tires there. Share to a page. That's what I'm doing, isn't it? I'm sharing to a page, and I'm going to share to the Scotty McClue page and let everybody know that we are live right now. Uh, excellent. Right, that's what's happening there. Now, if you've just joined us and you're wondering what else is happening, you've never heard of Scotty McClue, I'm the World Stop Broadcaster and the First Lord of the Internet. Hey, Scotty, how are you doing, says Lee Fern? Excellent, Lee. And uh, Ann Ingalls, Dinky Doo. Lee, can you see me pop up before you get in touch? Is that how it is from your side? What do you all see on Facebook when Scotty McClue pops up live? So there you are. Uh, a cold, and he mentions a, a brand, proprietary brand name. A cold cider going down a treat, says John Wilson. When I used to take a refreshment, John, I did enjoy a cider on a, a Friday evening, of course. Very, very good. So there we are. I shall just do 
Bit more sharing here. Excellent stuff. So that one's gone out there. Martin Rose watching. Didn't you do? Play the piano. It's Friday evening, says Tony Bamford. Now, if you look out, you'll see Scotty McClue playing a traditional tune. C-H-O-O-N, right? You'll see me. In fact, I'm wearing this tie. So you'll be able to spot it in a dark jacket. And you'll hear me playing the piano. Now... I think that's heading for number one in the charts. Let's see if we can get Scotty McClure's wee folk tune as number one in the charts. Wadge, dinky do. Your big kid, says Mama McTavish. Big kid, Momo. There you are, no problem. Hello, Scotty, says Callum Murray. So there you are. Momo sounds as if he's jealous of a big head. Have you got a wee head, Momo? Is that what you're saying? Have you just got a wee golf ball on top of a, a water jet? So, uh, Malcolm Wilson's watching. Dinky you do, Malcolm. Lovely to have you with us. You're all watching Scotty McClue and the Friday evening pop-up. The early tea time pop-up. I say, Berta King Patterns watching. What a fine, fine lady in Port Glasgow there. There, in the port. John Warren does watching Dinky Do. Welcome, welcome, I say. You're all watching Scotty McClue Friday evening pop up just for you. Dinky Do. Spread the word. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. If you're watching now, do a bit of sharing. That would be fabulous. I'm just going to share again because that seemed to go down rather well, I would say. So we'll see what we've got going here. Um, I'll just put in live now. In fact, wait and I'll just do that. Um, live now. Very, very important. Live now. And oh, W. There we go. Excellent. Was that taken there? Let me see. Live now. Yes. Was that taken? No. Oh, yes. There we are. Wonderful. Isn't it interesting? We've been able to type for years and years and years. But you have to get these things sorted out. Who's your favourite Scottish footballer? Says Tony Bamford. Oh, my goodness. Oi, oi, Scotty McClure. Says, you've got me there. That's a, that's an interesting one. Who's my favourite Scottish footballer? Well, well, that's, that's very interesting. Yes. I'm just trying to think here, and I'm just trying to think, what particular team, you know? Dave Bethel's watching Dinky Doo. Lovely to have you with us, Dave. I hope you are well. And uh, we will no doubt catch up at the next radio conference, I say. So there we are. That's a hard one, Tony Bamford. Leave that one with me. Uh, and we shall see what's what. Gary Sampson smiling away there. Uh, John Warrender, he's giving me his favourite footballer. We're not going into all that tonight. We don't do a lot of football on the Scotty McClure pop-ups. Uh, Scotty, mind I want your car wash tomorrow Pop into the co-op funeral care in Bells Hill Between 12 and 3 Wash and Hoover for a fiver In aid of the St Andrews Hospice Cheers, Gordy That's uh, Gordon White, so there you are uh, Between 12 and 3 uh, Co-op funeral care, Bells Hill And they'll wash your car and hoover it out for a fiver How you going, Scotty? This is Gary Sampson I am doing magnificently, thank you Lovely to hear from all of you. I just thought you'd enjoy a quick Friday night pop-up. So there we go. And uh, John Gray is watching. John Gray, lovely to have you with us as well. Keep sharing, guys. Keep sharing. I'm just going to share this one out. Let everybody know what's what. And uh, let everybody know Scott McClure is live. So excellent stuff. Paul Whiteman, dinky do. So there you are. Lovely to have you with us, of course. I cannot comment on anything like that at all. In fact, we'll have to just take that comment out right away. So there you are. And I shall have a look at that later. Now then, Gary Davis is watching. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us, Gary. And um, a warm welcome to the Scotty McClure. Friday evening pop-up. Thanks, Scotty. Great cause. No problem, Gordy. And uh, I hope a lot of people turn up. I shall be elsewhere. 
at that time tomorrow, I have to say, but I shall send as many people along as I possibly can. Nick Baldy's watching. Nick Baldy, good evening. He says, good evening to you, Nick Baldy. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. Now, it's been a fabulous, fabulous week for the Scotty McClue pop-ups, as I say, folks. Uh, 20,000 of you have viewed them to date, and a lot more of you are viewing. Karmic McCusker, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us as well. Welcome to the Scotty McClue Friday evening pop-up just for you to say dinky do. Who inspired you to become your favourite broadcaster? Says Tommy Bamford. Oh my goodness me, I've had a lot of inspiration over the years. Uh, the great Sir Terry Wogan and Jimmy Young, they were very, very big in my life. And my old chum John Myers was very helpful. He was the one that started this off at Red Rose Radio in 1992. Share, 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 says Paul Whiteman. Jerry McGurk. But I think uh, Sir Terry Wogan and Jimmy Young, great broadcasters. Ken Bruce, another great broadcaster. But I can go back to the likes of Robin Day and uh, Ludovic Kennedy, and all these broadcasters, Alistair Burnett, excellent stuff, um, share, 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 there we are, Sandy Gall, all these fabulous, fabulous broadcasters, uh, and of course I can go back to the wonderful Mary Malcolm, the first television announcer, and I can remember, I think it must have been the 50th anniversary of the BBC, and Mary Malcolm appeared in continuity. Fantastic. And also, um, who else? Mac appeared as well. So there you are. Tremendous stuff. Just found you, Scotty. Used to love your nighttime radio show. Irene Garvey, dinky do, and a weak kiss to you. And I send you strength, my dear. I hope you are okay and that, uh, you know, you're coping with things as they are. We have to, don't we? We have to just get on with it. Strength, strength, strength to Irene Garvey. Uh, you've inspired me a lot, big man, and gave me sir ribs too. So there you are. Well, we like to think that that we do have an inspirational side to us, Nick. You know, I think it's very, very important. Always remember, I can and I will. That's the thing. I can and I will. Radio is being swallowed up by mergers. Yes, it is. But there are new stations emerging. So you're always going to have, I mean, they said this when groups were being formed in Scotland. And then along came Scott FM and just blew them all away. Fantastic stuff. And that radio station should still have been going. It shouldn't have been interfered with. Scott FM should still be on the air because it was Scotland's finest radio hour. And it was owned and run by Scots. Tremendous stuff. Uh, so there we are. But radio will always get swallowed up because people are money-driven. They want to hear the money. But unfortunately, the creative output doesn't necessarily match. So there you are. But, um, you know, because you want to try a bit of experimental stuff as well. I mean, I can remember when I was to do with a radio station in central Scotland and a lot to do with the programming. And boy, was that station popular, you know, because we just got it right. But we did things like maybe had a show at night for new bands, for new talent. And I think you've always got to make way. There's room for everyone in uh, in the media. You know, there's stats to do. Aye, so you should still be on radio too, says Nick Baldy. Well, who knows? That might come. I am yet young. I haven't even scratched the surface. I've got my whole life ahead of me, and I've got my whole career ahead of me. Lakeland Radio has gone uh, gone somewhere, he, he says, Paul Whiteman. So there we are, he mentions companies. I'm not going to go into all that, because that's an opinion, Paul. Eddie Dobby Sr.'s watching Dinky Doo, and sometimes radio stations have to merge just to survive, you know, because it's a bit of a, a battle, it's a bit of a jungle out there, to be quite honest. So you need to be very, very good commercially to be surviving. Uh, if you've just joined us, folks, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, Friday night pop-up, just to say Dinky Doo to every single one of you. And uh, how's the time doing? Oh, my goodness me. 
It's uh, about twenty past six. It's time I wasn't here, I say. But it's marvellous to be with you all. Now then, um, lots and lots to talk about in the pop-ups. Remember, you set the agenda, but the big picture is to get us all on Facebook together, watching the show together. Absolutely, as many people as you can muster. So you need to make them aware that we're on, which means you need to share and share. I like your tie, Scotty. You're better dressed than the local golf cup president, Cameron Erach. That is a huge compliment indeed, because I have an idea of which golf club you are talking about. No names, no pack drill. I say, get the message. Sir Cameron Erich there on watching Scotty McClue, Dinky Doo. Councillor Henry Anderson watching Dinky Doo. Henry, I hope it's all going well with you. Lots and lots of things to talk about and so little time to do it in. It's always the way, isn't it? I can remember people used to say to me, how come, how do you manage to fill an hour on a Sunday night with chit chat? And I said, I managed, I said, I could fill three hours. You know, we've never got enough time to cover it. You enjoy your weekend, big man. See you Sunday, says Nick Baldy. I'll see you all Sunday, guys. Share this broadcast throughout the evening so that people get a chance to see it. And uh, until Sunday night at um, 9 o'clock sharp, live here on Facebook Live. Be there or be square. Never, ever miss a moment of Scotty McClue or you miss a moment of life. So there you are. Is that you ready for a skinfa? No, Jerry McGurk, I didn't attack a skinfa. I'm ready for a hot chocolate. And you should be doing the same. Whatever you're doing, guys, and wherever you are, have a fabulous Friday evening. Have a great weekend. Come and join us on Sunday night at 9 o'clock sharp, Facebook Live. This is Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet, saying to every single one of you, dinky-doo, bye, lads.